This is Proof Weight Loss Surgery Works and I am your Sunday blogger, Rosemary. Welcome! Your favorite foods then and now. What are your favorite foods post weight loss surgery? Why are they your favorite foods now? Taste? Easy to eat? Do they meet your daily nutrition needs? Keep you full the longest? Are they the same favorites you chose pre weight loss surgery? Can you share with us your perfect day of eating post weight loss surgery? Okay. I'm going to try. I, I don't have samples of anything. I'm sorry. I, uh, I should have been better prepared. But anyway, I'm going to talk you through it and I'm going to show you something too. So stay with me. Okay. My morning uh, is, uh, especially now that it's summertime, I'm doing a protein shake. But what I do is the first thing I do is I wear my uh, bodysuit. If you guys want to know what the bodysuit looks like, you got to go to Gastric Rose and you'll see. I just happen to have it here because I took it off this morning, but it's a bodysuit and it's made, it's made like that material uh, that you would get into uh, for diving stuff. It's really awesome. I love it. And you can get that from Avon in Curves. And it's making me sweat and it, I, can, I can already feel the difference. I don't know if it's up here or really down here. <laughs> but I'm loving it. I love the energy I get with it. Okay, but we're not talking about exercise, are we? Okay, Rosemary. Uh, okay, here we go. In the morning, I will have a protein shake with some uh, fruit. Uh, after I do a two-hour work... I, I'm doing two hours, guys. I'm not saying for you to do two-hour workout. But I do a two-hour workout. I do three tapes. And uh, they're called, uh, I don't have, uh, Body Flex. I do two Body Flex ones, and I do a walking with Leslie Sansom. Sansom. Anyway. Uh, and she does four miles. So it takes me about two hours to complete it. And I will only have in the morning my coffee with my husband at five in the morning. And uh, then I make sure to drink lots of water. I have at least 16 ounces of water before I do my exercise. Do my exercise. Uh, then I go take a shower, do my protein shake. My protein shake, it's just the way, regular Walmart way. Uh, I've been trying the Jillian protein. I like that. I like the chocolate flavor of that. A lot of people don't like it, but I do. It costs $10 for a little, I mean, whatever they, Walmart has. It's always $10. And so I vary from the vanilla way to the chocolate. And uh, I like the vanilla because I can add a banana to it if I want with a little bit of cinnamon. Mmm, it's delicious. Or I do strawberries and uh, banana. Mmm. Or I do uh, the chocolate with uh, a little bit of coffee. Mmm. <laughs> okay, so that's my breakfast. Then I will, uh, for lunch, I will try and do a little bit of tuna or fish. Now, I love fish. I am just crazy that way, but I just love fish. It's easy for me to get down, and it's a lot of protein. Uh, if I'm still hungry after a little piece of fish, which I'm usually not, but if I am, about an hour later, I will have a little bit of yogurt. Now, let me tell you what I'm doing with my yogurt. I will have some Greek yogurt, and I will mix a Fiber One Key Lime. They're this little. They're called Fiber One and they come in raspberry or key lime and I love the key lime. Oh, so good. And I, I'll, I'll use half of the key lime with another little bit of maybe two tablespoons of uh, Greek yogurt and it sweetens it for me and it's delicious guys. I may add a little bit more trivia or sweet and low because that's the only thing that I, my body can handle. I can't do Splenda. So anyway, that's a little, uh, I can do that for lunch or I can do that for snack. Uh, the yogurt. The fish, uh, I try and have fish for lunch or maybe lentil soup, things I've made and I can warm up. Um, I'm trying to get this all in 10 minutes, guys. Um, I apologize, I'm going too fast. Okay. Then for dinner, it will always be, it will always be a, uh, a protein and a vegetable. And it's basically chicken, fish, uh, I love ribs. I'm a Texas girl from heart and I will eat ribs with uh, usually my vegetables. I, I do all kinds of vegetables so I just can't name one but my favorite is uh, broccoli and cauliflower. I like to do the cauliflower. If, if I'm wanting something like, a, like uh, a mashed potatoes I will take cauliflower 
uh, mash it up with some butter, a little bit of butter, because I also dump with uh, uh, butter, but I do a little bit of butter and salt and oh, so good. Um, okay, and then uh, I wanted to show you this book that I bought. Uh, I got this at Half Price Books a while back. I don't remember if it was here in California or Dallas. I think it was Dallas though. It's called Low Carb Cuisine. Okay, and I've gotten a lot of great recipes from this. Uh, one day I will share. I, I really don't think I have time, but I wanted to share you some share with you something that I do. I happen to go again to the swap meet with Christina. I'm having so much fun with Christina. Thank you, thank you for inviting me. She comes, picks me up, and we go to the swap meet because it, it's over by my house. Let me show you what I did today. I was at the swap meet, and uh, I bought some uh, poblano peppers. And they're green, and they're kind, they're the same peppers that you would use for chile rellenos if you ever go to a restaurant, okay? And what I did is I, I put them over the fire on your, on, your, on your stove, and then you peel them. And uh, then they're, they turn out to be uh, green, okay? Well, they're green anyway. Anyway, this has a sauce that I make with cream cheese. This is just one little cream cheese, and it looks like a lot of, of sauce, but it's not. I use sour cream and, and cream cheese and salt. That's all it is, guys. And let me tell you, this stuff, oh my goodness. If you ever make it, you are going to thank me. Mmm. It's good. I've even made this with just regular old um, orange and red peppers. You can do that over the fire too. Take the, you wanna, you wanna peel them. Uh, because uh, they can be kind of bitter with the, with the skins on them. But I've done them with the skins too. Mm. It is so good, guys. You don't need anything else but that. It's delicious. I hope I've helped. And please come back next Sunday. I didn't do anything elaborate today. Or, you know, I didn't share pictures. I totally apologize for that. But um, stay tuned for all the other vloggers. I'm sure they're going to... Do a great job. I will see you when? Next Sunday. Bye for now.